hello and welcome back to the channel friends i hope you guys are doing absolutely fine so today i am going to give you dictation for a transcription number 22 the speed of the dictation will be 70 words per minute there are about 800 words in this dictation so the dictation length will be around 11 and a half minutes the dictation will begin in 10 seconds so be ready for it five four three two one start coming to the internal affairs of the country madam deputy chairman the policies of the government of india for the last 15 years have been so manipulated that the rich people are becoming richer and the poorer sections of the people are becoming still poorer the committee that has been appointed to investigate into the question of the distribution of income has not yet given its verdict but it is common knowledge that the people who are in the higher ups have become more rich and the people in the lower rung have become poorer. The prices of essential commodities that the peasants and the workers use have gone up so high that they are not within the reach of the mass of the people of the country. Government have not taken adequate steps to bring down the prices and to stabilize the prices as was recommended by the food grains committee we are now in the third plan while the plans are progressing the number of the unemployed in the country is increasing this is a very anomalous position. It is the government alone that can explain why in spite of the plans the unemployment problem is becoming more and more acute. As was rightly pointed out yesterday by some speakers our agriculture has not been paid due attention that should have been paid to in a country where 80 percent of the people live on land some three or four years back when mr Ajit Prasad Jain was the food and agriculture minister. He was made to resign under shady circumstances as one who had proved not capable of solving the food problem in the country. A suggestion was thrown that the portfolio of agriculture should be handled by an important and senior member of the cabinet and particularly in the states by the chief ministers of the states. But nothing of the sort has 
happened whatever increase in food grains output we have obtained is not because of any increase in the yield per acre but because of extensive cultivation more land has been brought under cultivation and some irrigation facilities have now been provided but the increase that we have seen is not in keeping with the demand that is necessary for us to feed 400 million in india so whatever industrial development we want the basic factor is that our agricultural economy should be improved for that all efforts should be made more fertilizers should be used and new methods of cultivation should be employed for growing more food crops and for growing other cash crops in a review that was published by the planning commission itself they have pointed out that there is acute shortage of power in more than 50% of the states in india we have accepted a planned economy we have completed two plans and we are now in the third plan i do not know why the planning commission or the planners concerned did not foresee this shortage of power in most of the states in india and why they did not plan generation of more power so that people will not accuse the state governments or the planning commission that they did not work out the plans properly in order to have more industries and to have more food grains produced through lift irrigation in most of the states in andhra in west bengal in bihar in karnataka there is power shortage whatever power is available now is being rationed there are thousands of units of small scale industries which are not working for want of power and there are thousands of lift irrigation pumps which are denied power supply for purposes of irrigating their lands and wherever power is supplied it is supplied during nights which is not very convenient to make use of the power and use the power for agricultural purposes the finance minister in the statement that he made in the lok sabha and which was placed before us has 
stated that it was assessed that for the successful implementation of the plan even after taking every possible measure for the development of our exports which clearly must be given the highest priority we would need external assistance of the order of rupees 2600 crores and we have however been less successful in obtaining and utilizing the external assistance required for financing the imports necessary for our developing economy to industrialize our country and to bring it on par with other well developed countries we do need assistance financial technical and other assistance the finance minister was so hopeful that he was getting rupees 2600 crores of foreign aid from aid india club and other countries but now he is not hopeful of getting that amount which is necessary to fulfill the targets in the third five year plan to isi ke sath dictation khatam hoti hai i hope aap logo ne acche se dictation likha hoga isme kuch words aaye hain jaise states ke naam hai andhra west bengal bihar karnataka तो इसमें आप ये कर सकते हो कि जैसे वेस्ट बंगाल है तो आप शॉर्ट में डब्ल्यू बी लिख के आगे बढ़ जाओ बिहार है तो बी आर लिख के आगे बढ़ जाओ कर्नाटका है तो के आर लिख के आगे बढ़ जाओ जो भी उस स्टेट का रजिस्ट्रेशन प्लेट होता है जैसे यूपी का यूपी है राजस्थान का आर जे है गुजरात का जी जे है वो लिख करके आप आगे बढ़ सकते हो शॉर्ट में बाद में जब आप उसको ट्रांसक्राइब करोगे उसको आप इरेजर से मिटा कर, उसके जगह पर गुजरात का आउटलाइन बना सकते हो इसमें कोई इशू नहीं अगर आप इरेज नहीं भी करते भूल भी जाते हो डिक्टेशन के टाइम पे या कॉपी सबमिट करने के टाइम में तो भी कोई इशू नहीं है कुछ एक वर्ड्स अगर आप लिख देते हो इंग्लिश में तो वो चलते हैं बस आपको ध्यान दे रहा है कि आप ज्यादा दो तीन लाइन ना लिख दो इंग्लिश में कुछ एक वर्ड से कोई फर्क नहीं पड़ता सो so, ये आखिरी डिक्टेशन थी कैलाश चंद्र वॉल्यूम वन की इसके बाद वॉल्यूम टू शुरू होगा और मैं उम्मीद करता हूं कि आप लोगों ने 70 वर्ड्स पर मिनट की स्पीड अचीव कर ली होगी आफ्टर प्रैक्टिसिंग ऑल दिस 22 टू ट्रांसक्रिप्शन सो वॉल्यूम टू स्टार्ट होगी 80 वर्ड पर मिनट से और उसकी सेकेंड वाली होगी 90 वर्ड्स पर मिनट सो जो लोग भी अभी 70 वर्ड्स पर मिनट की स्पीड पे हैं और उनकी स्पीड अचीव नहीं हो पाई अब तक भी पूरा वन वॉल्यूम करने के बाद आपको मैं सलाह दूंगा कि आप एक बार फिर से पूरी वॉल्यूम कंटिन्यू करो वन टू ट्वेंटी टू आप फिर से लिखो दो बार तीन बार चार बार लिखो जब तक कि आपकी स्पीड सेवेंटी अच्छे से ना आ जाए फिर आप वॉल्यूम टू से एट्टी वर्ड्स पर मिनट स्टार्ट करना उसकी डिक्टेशन भी दो चार दिन में अपलोड होना शुरू हो जाएंगी सो थैंक यू सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट ट्रांसक्रिप्शन